Hey you guys, it's Debbie Pine. I've got things to say. Oh, I definitely have things to say right now. Okay. I used to sell Mary Kay. And I still have some Mary Kay that I thought, oh, I'm going to use this today. I'm going to show people, you know, hey, this this is a good product. You know, just because it's an MLM product doesn't mean it's crap. You know, uh, support your, your fellow women that are trying to make money. You know, this is a wonderful product. Hmm. Everything that I'm laying down on top of this Mary Kay makeup, I'm using uh, their BB cream, which is like your skin but better, just like, you know, um, uh, oh God, just like the Born This Way or, you know, anything like that. Oh God, I'm, I'm trying to lay down bronzer, which, yeah, I don't know if you guys can see this, I, I put down bronzer, which I normally use on top of any kind of foundation that I have, and this is patchy. I've, I've done everything I can do to just buff this out. I, uh, it, it's awful. I'm using the Mary Kay, uh, the Mary Kay concealer to underneath my eyes. And it's creasing up, as you can see right there. And it's not allowing me to blend this makeup like I want to do. I want to show you guys this fall look, of course, with the, you know, the Nudie Tootie palette, you know, I want to go back and, uh, you know, do this beautiful fall look, but I can't even get these things to blend out like I want it to. You see how it's patchy underneath the eye? You guys, you guys know I can blend makeup. Look at that. It, it's not blending. Why? Nothing's blending on top of this Mary Kay makeup. You know, my, my blush is not blending. It's, it's patchy. It's, oh, it's frustrating to go from selling a makeup that I thought was absolutely wonderful you know, um, I, I'm going to make lots of money doing this, you know, um, I, I love selling Mary Kay because it's just, we're going to support our, our fellow ladies, you know, we're going to do this. Guys, I, I can't say that I can support makeup where they're not trying to perfect the product. Sorry. <laughs> they're not trying to, to make the product any better. These people have had 50, 60 years to make products better, and they're not even trying. This, uh, you know, they, they've been making concealer and foundation for all them years, you know, and, and still nothing, still it's not any better. When we've got all these other products, like I've got Smashbox and this stuff's better. I've got, uh, my God, even Broadway, this stuff right here, this is like two dollars at the Dollar General store and this as a eye primer works better than the concealer that I paid 30 bucks for at Mary Kay how I and I know this is a rant you guys are like ooh, you know I don't usually go in here and just gripe about stuff I uh, gripe about you know makeup I, because I love all makeup I'm like yes well I can usually work with anything I can work with with two dollar makeup palettes and I can work with a hundred dollar makeup palettes you know I don't have to have nudie patootie I don't have to have this fifty dollar makeup palette and because I can go from working from that to uh two dollar elf stuff I, I don't care you know it's not the the price of things that matter to me it's does it work the thirty dollar concealer does not work it, if it doesn't work it's not worth the price look at this it's, it's patchy and gross I mean And that goes for unique and that goes for that lifeline or lime life or whatever it is by Alcone that goes for all that stuff because if you're selling products as an MLM you are selling a little bit of a product that is only perfected to a to a small amount and people are going to repurchase those products because they're just trying to support you as a family member you know unique screwed up when they changed their products their their uh, mascara products and that was changed I don't know over two years ago I think so you know the reason that people are still buying that unique mascara is because they're just trying to support you as a family member well it, it's not that good anymore same thing with the Mary Kay eyeshadows and the Mary Kay um, you know concealers and the foundations. It, it's not that good. My mother only bought that stuff. My mother only spent uh, $500 because I was selling the junk. The Lime Life Balacone or Lime, Lime Life or whatever you want to call it. Yes, it was made for makeup artists. And let's see, look at this. See how patchy this is? Look at that. Okay. That stuff, yes, it started as being made for makeup artists. 
However, it's a lot cheaper for makeup artists when you go to Viseart or when you go to, when you buy it, you know, where it's cheaper, okay? Don't buy through Lime Life or Life Life and all that crap, okay? There's other places you can buy that same stuff for a heck of a lot cheaper, okay? Don't let these people swindle you into buying this stuff because it's not good. It's not good. The MLM makeup game is a lie. And you guys know that I like to review MLM products. I like to tell you <clears throat> what the truth is of these things. Um, well, this is the truth, you guys. Yeah, I sold Mary Kay for a little while. Not long. A couple months. Because nobody would buy it because they know the truth now. Everybody knows the truth now. That this stuff, no matter how much you work with it. And I, ha I have done this. And I worked with my face. And this part of my eyes and all that. For about an hour. I, this has taken me an hour. Where normally I can get this done in probably 30 minutes. This would be about 30 minutes, you know. Because you guys know I can do makeup. Uh, makeup not a problem for me. I can get it done like that. This should not take me an hour. It's, this should have blended out. This should have blended out by now. I mean, I, I'm rubbing my face raw by trying to do this. Anyway, you guys. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not trying to put anything down or anybody down. You know, if if Mary Kay does have one good thing, it is uh, their um, face products, their uh, their um, facial cleansers, and their uh, uh, moisturizers. They do have facial clean, good facial cleansers and good moisturizers. I can say that 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 is some good stuff, and it's it's comparable to what you're going to get at the, the drugstore now. You know, Neutrogena costs just as much as uh, Mary Kay. If you're going to buy from Mary Kay, buy their facial stuff. Buy the cleansers, buy the masks, that sort of stuff. Don't buy makeup from MLM places. Don't do it. Go to Ulta. Go to Sephora. God, go to Walmart. Okay? <laughs> you can get it better at Walmart nowadays than you can through an MLM company. We'll do some more MLM stuff. If you guys have any questions for me, or if you want to send me some MLM products, if you want to send me something, I'll test it. No problem. If you think that your product is comparable to anything else, let me know. If you think that your product, that's an MLM product, can stand up to something that I can buy at Sephora or Ulta, send it to me. We'll find out, okay? I'd love to know. Anyway, I hope that you guys are having a great day. And remember, my God, to supply all my needs. Courtiers, riches, and glory by Christ Jesus. Bye.